uh, yet, yet another uh, sort of, I'll call it a, a, a cool stuff found redux, but, which we've had. Uh, now this will be the third one, I believe, this week. But, yeah, I mean, it's been three to ten years since we've mentioned some of these. So it, they are well due for a uh, re-mention. So. Yes, so the uh, the first one, did you know that your Mac is doing all sorts of things in the background to protect you from malicious software? Um, but you may not even know that's happening. Well, here's how you can know what's happening. Uh, it's an app called Silent Night from our friends at Eclectic Light. Uh, and it basically gives you the... Uh, the lowdown, it will show you uh, versions of various security things. It'll tell you with system integrity protection and what is SSV? I don't even know what that is. Um, uh, Xprotect, which is their, uh, you know, show you the version of that. And actually, uh, and the versions of some other things. But what's really nice, the version of Gatekeeper, what's really nice is that it'll show you if a database is not up to date. And this actually happened on my system. It was like, oh, dude, your XProtect database is, is old. Do you want to update it? And it's like, okay. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah. So something you may want to run every now and then just to make sure that all your security stuff is uh, uh, the way it should be. I, I now remember I, I we looked before the show to see how recently we had mentioned this, and it, it had been three years I now remember exactly when I found out about this, John, and you were there. And in fact, I caused you and me and, and a bunch of other people great headache. Uh, there's nothing wrong with this app. I highly recommend using this app. Don't do what I do. What I did, though, we were at MacStock in person uh, in, I believe, 2019. And someone on stage, I'm going to guess it was Brett Terpstra, but who knows? I don't know who it was. Someone either on stage or in the room mentioned Silent Night. I'm like, oh, this sounds amazing. So I ran it and it said updates available. And I clicked install all updates because I wanted to be, be up to date, you know. Uh, and it said, well, for one of these updates, you need to restart your Mac. I'm like, I don't want to restart right now. That's fine. But whatever. Later that day, you and I had a live in person Mac Geek Gab to record. And we, through the process, there was something wrong with the USB interface that didn't want to work. And so I'm like, well, let me just restart my Mac. And so I restarted my Mac for the first time since clicking the install all updates button earlier that day in silent night. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> 20, 25 minutes of updating Mac OS happened with a room full of people waiting to see a podcast about how to how to properly manage your Mac. <laughs> there was so much irony. It was dripping from the ceiling folks. Yeah. So, uh, you know, it was fine. It, it was one of those things where it humanized the whole thing, which we love to do here. I mean, we have problems with our computers just like you. In fact, it's the fact that we try new stuff all the time and break things that allows us to be able to do what we do for all of you, like it, this is part of how it works. And, and you got to see the sausage being made in a in a fantastic way. But uh, yeah, so that's um, that's when I learned about Silent Night, John. 